Chapter 1. Maintaining Physical Balance Maintaining physical balance. Have you ever tried to balance on one leg? It can be a bit tricky, can't it? Well, don't worry. In this chapter, we will learn all about physical balance and how to improve it. Physical balance is when your body can stay steady and in control. It helps you in many different activities, like walking, running, or even standing in line for your favorite ice cream. One way to improve physical balance is by doing yoga. Yoga is a type of exercise that helps you stretch and strengthen your body. It also helps you focus and find balance both physically and mentally. In yoga, there are many different poses that can help you improve your balance. One such pose is called the tree pose. To do the tree pose, stand tall and lift one foot off the ground. Then, place the sole of your foot on the inside of your opposite leg. Try to keep your balance as you hold this pose for a few deep breaths. Don't worry if you wobble a little at first. It takes practice to find your balance. Another great way to improve physical balance is by doing balance exercises. Balance exercises are fun activities that challenge your body to stay steady. One example of a balance exercise is the flamingo stand. Stand on one leg and raise your other leg out to the side, bending your knee slightly. You can even try closing your eyes to make it more challenging. See how long you can hold this position without wobbling. Good posture also plays a big role in maintaining physical balance. Posture is the way you hold your body when you are sitting, standing, or even walking. When you have good posture, it helps your body stay aligned and balanced. So, remember to stand up straight and tall, with your shoulders back and your head held high. Don't forget to relax your muscles, too. Now that you know some tips for maintaining physical balance, let's try a little test to see how well you can balance. Stand up and find a clear space where you won't bump into anything. Imagine you have a tightrope in front of you. Slowly walk along the imaginary tightrope, placing one foot right in front of the other. Try to keep your balance and walk as straight as you can. You can even add some arm movements to challenge yourself even more. Wow, great job! You did an amazing job at maintaining your physical balance. Remember, the more you practice, the better you will get. So, keep doing yoga, balance exercises, and be mindful of your posture. Your body will thank you, and you will feel more confident in your movements. In the next chapter, we will dive into nutrition and how it can help us maintain a healthy body. Until then, keep practicing and don't forget to stay in balance. Question. What are some tips for improving your physical balance? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 2. Achieving Emotional Balance As we continue our journey to achieving emotional balance, let's explore the incredible power of deep breathing. Take a deep breath in and exhale slowly. Doesn't that feel good? Deep breathing is a simple yet effective technique that can help us regain control of our emotions. Imagine this, you're feeling overwhelmed by a wave of emotions. Your heart is racing and you can't seem to calm down. That's when deep breathing steps in as your superhero. It gives you the strength to conquer any emotional storm that arises. But wait, you're not alone in this. Reach out for support from your loved ones. They can be your guiding light when you're feeling unsure. Whether it's a family member, a friend, or even a loyal pet, they can offer comfort and understanding when you need it most. Let's meet our friend Lily, who recently discovered the power of emotional balance. One day, she woke up feeling a mix of sadness and anger she couldn't shake off. It felt like a dark cloud was following her everywhere she went. Lily couldn't understand why she was feeling this way, and that made her even more frustrated. Then, Lily remembered what she had learned about deep breathing. It was her secret weapon to restore balance within herself. So, she closed her eyes, 
placed her hand on her belly and took a long, deep breath in through her nose. Lily could feel her tummy rise like a balloon as she filled it with air. She held her breath for a moment and then slowly exhaled through her mouth, imagining the negative feelings leaving her body with each breath. This simple practice allowed Lily to reconnect with her inner joy. She found solace in the present moment, letting go of worries about the past and future. Deep breathing became her anchor, helping her navigate through the stormy seas of emotions. But let's not forget the importance of loved ones in Lily's journey. Whenever she felt overwhelmed, Lily confided in her mom, who always knew how to comfort her. She would wrap Lily in a warm embrace, assuring her that everything would be okay. Lily's mom encouraged her to continue practicing deep breathing and reminded her that emotions are a normal part of life. With the support and love of her mom, Lily learned how to connect with her own emotions. She understood that it was okay to feel sad, angry, or even frustrated. What mattered most was how she responded to those emotions. By practicing deep breathing and seeking the support of her loved ones, Lily was able to find her inner balance again. So, dear friends, remember this. Deep breathing and the support of loved ones can guide you towards emotional balance. Take a moment to breathe in deep and exhale all your worries. Reach out to those who care about you and let them be your cheerleaders. With their support and the power of deep breathing, you can conquer any emotional challenges that come your way. Question, how can we achieve emotional balance? Check the video description for the answer.